Well, what's up y'all? Welcome back to our channel. We are so excited because this weekend we are going on a road trip to Mineral Wells. It's a small town here in Texas, just a couple hours from us. So we've got little bones with us. We're getting gas right now. We're just gonna get on the road. Karate. Well, we made it to Mineral Wells. We've been wanting to go around and explore some more like Texas towns around us. So we figured we would just bring y'all along and show you what we see. Of course, the first thing we wanted to come to is the historic Baker Hotel. It was built in 1929 and it went out of business in 1979 and it's been abandoned ever since then, but they're actually renovating it right now. So it's supposed to be opening again as a functional hotel and spa. And what did they say? 2026. Yeah, two years. Yeah, so it's really cool actually to be here before it reopens. We were here several years ago and it's even in way better condition than it was back then. It looks like they've fixed all the exterior windows. When we were here several years ago, it was graffitied. Most of the windows were broken out. Uh, and these fences weren't here. They've put in so many more fences so that you can't get any closer. You used to be able to actually walk up those steps in the front. The right from here seems so far away, but you could just walk up that, walk all around the wraparound terrace. But they've got it all closed off and they're working on it. It's a beautiful historic hotel. It's really cool that they're going to be reopening it. Yeah, I mean, that's like the wall that we used to look over. Uh-huh. <laughs> Allegedly, we would just look over that wall. Yeah. <laughs> Allegedly. Oh, look at the roof tiles. Oh, yeah, sweet. Huh. Very tall in it. Yeah. That's, cool. that's going to be the old ones, honestly, because those look pretty nice. Yeah, those look fresh. I hope they'll keep a lot of the original stuff, whatever they can. It's so beautiful. And like the original coloring, like that teal. Yeah, me too. I really hope they keep it classy. Yeah. Keep it old school like that. Yeah, because this also yeah, is an area you could see very clearly over this yes. wall. <laughs> And there might be some alleged <laughs> photos <laughs> from Keep Exploring days <laughs> on the other side of that fence. Allegedly. Allegedly. Wow, it was one of the first hotels that had AC. Yeah. That was one of their luxury amenities. AC and ice cold water yeah, delivered right to the rooms. <laughs> Which honestly, hotels now don't even really give you ice cold water. <laughs> no, you get like two bottles in your Yeah, you get a bottle of water and like sink water, but... Oh, I didn't even think to turn around and let Bones look. It's like I've been keeping my back. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's kind of looking... <laughs> he's facing this way. Wait, Bones, look up there. He's not... doesn't seem to be interested in the uh, historic hotel, <laughs> unfortunately. <laughs> Can you get a better... There he is. Hey, buddy. Is he just laying down? No, he's like sitting up now. Nice. He is a little more curious. So this town only has a population of like 14,000. It's actually a really small town. Back when this was like, you know, really booming, this was a destination spot. People would come vacation here. Um, it wasn't somewhere that people were really moving to. So whenever the Great Depression happened, this wasn't a easily accessible thing for people to come and do anymore. It was such a luxury to be able to travel here and stay in the spas. It officially closed uh, in the 70s and has been abandoned ever since, like 50 years of being abandoned. <laughs> the 
there's someone watching us. <laughs> so that's the Baker Hotel. We'll probably come back and show y'all more just because we really want to come back and look at it more. But right now we're going to go to the original well that uh, people found the mineral water in when this town was founded. And that's why this hotel was even built. People would come from all over to sit in the spas, to drink the water. It's really rich in minerals. And I also was reading that it's kind of rich in lithium, which can help with like mental illnesses and diseases. And so back in the late 1800s, a man drilled a well that is still here. And that's where the crazy water bottling factory is. So if y'all have ever seen the crazy water bottles, it's still bottled uh, here, right out of the water underneath mineral wells. And this hotel was built as a spa destination so that people could come and enjoy all of the health benefits of the mineral rich waters. So yeah, we can drive over there. It's really not far. Like I said, this is such a small town. Everything is really condensed pretty closely. So come on. <laughs> <laughs> So we're here at the original site of the Crazy Water Well. This is why Mineral Wells is famous. It is its namesake. And I'm not sure if that's the well <laughs> or this is the well. <laughs> looks more like the well I think but... that one looks more like the historic photo. sparkling too, how yeah. cool. And they used to sell it not just as water, but as crystals so that you could take it back home with you. Oh, there they are. Crazy water crystals. Oh yeah, Dismuke, that's the founder. Dismuke's famous mineral crystals. Wow. I know I've tried all these before, but it still feels like dry at some point. Yeah. Oh, there's all the things in it, huh? How is it? Not as crazy as I remember. Really? I don't know, maybe I've just gotten more accustomed to craziness. Will you pour me a little? Mm hmm Just like, that's good. I think the first time I tried it, it seemed like it was like, Overwhelming. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, I don't even think that. we like drank sparkling water back then, so. We got them. We got them. crazy. Yep. So we got some sparkling ones because we've never tried. Last time we were here, they didn't have sparkling water. Or maybe they did and we didn't want I it. Did. I don't think they did either. I think they have a lot more options now. There are one more option now. <laughs> sparkling. They have one more option. <laughs> and then we got two bottles of the number four. And the way it works is they have one through four and it's based on the depth that they drill in the well. So it's more mineral rich, the higher to the surface they drill. So the four is first, I think Alex said it's like 130 feet down, followed by two, maybe, do you know how many more feet down it is? It, I think it was like roughly like 100 feet deeper each level. Okay. Right. Infused by mother nature. Nice. Crazy good. <laughs> uh, this is a number three, the sparkling Oh, the one sparkling is. is a number three. It's honestly kind of delicious. I do agree that that's delicious. You heard it first here, folks. It's delicious. The first people to acknowledge <laughs> <laughs> how crazy good this water that's is. That's right. It's crazy good. <laughs> it does look stormy out here. I know. Doesn't it look stormy out here? Not safe. Yeah, because so, I'm pretty sure up here is the bathhouse and spa. Oh, yeah, let's the, go see. Right. And this was his property. Back in the 1800s, he lived on this property. And that's where the well was, obviously. And it was like thousands of people would come from all over and they would sleep and camp out on his property. And he would sell cups of water from the well for five cents a piece. And that was the original, like, start of the business. 
Oh wow, and here's the bathhouse. Yeah. Mineral baths, massage, and spa treatments. That'd be really nice someday. Yeah. It's a different trip for us. <laughs> yeah, it's not really our style. Cool. <laughs> the birds are out today. Not it. There it is. Deep in the distance. Oh, the closer I... one is the Crazy Water Hotel. Which I... we'll go over there too. But the further one is the Baker back there. There's a lot of really giant, very historic buildings in this town that are abandoned. And it really shows how it was more of a tourist destination back in the day. And there weren't a lot of actual year-long residents who lived here. Yeah, you can see in and see the like operating table, That's dentist table. so or cool. Something, maybe not an operating table, but some type of medical. Yeah, well, that's like a big light. And... It's like maybe it could be dentistry. Yeah. Wow. Seeing these other windows. Oh, a cool sink with a tiny little bottle. Oh, I wish I could have that bottle. <laughs> she wants the bottle. I want that little bottle. Yeah, there's a bunch. She needs to be all the way in there, too. Oh, wow. Sitting over there is like a big jug of something. Whoa, this one has another, uh, what you're calling an operating table, but it's it's not. We know it's not an That's operating not an table. It's not an operating table, but it's some type of medical table. Some type of lay down on this table and we'll fix you right up. Oh, here, we hold this. I want to yeah. try to take a picture through that with my... Love that sound. It's a great sound. Pretty sure the first time we were here, they had like tiny, like I don't think that big crazy hotel was open. I think there was just rooms at this place you could rent. I, think I remember right. talking to them and they were like, yeah, we've got rooms to rent. And it was more just like a cottage Airbnb type situation. You're right. I really didn't remember the crazy hotel. Yeah, but that was the first time we were here was like 12 years ago? Yeah. 13 years ago? It was ago. before we were married. Yeah, before we were married, so it was a while back. At least 11 years. Oh, is that a little food pantry? Maybe so, let's check it out. It's a free library. Hmm. Dang, that's some high quality plexiglass work. Yeah, and look at this. I don't even know how to open it. Whoa, look how thick. They're like, rain is not getting on yeah, these books. Yeah, this is nice. The schooling of the Western horse. It's like not a book you normally see in like the... <laughs> no. Well, July 1970, and with love to our precious little Risley Lee? Misty? Misty? Misty. Oh, Misty. Yeah, Misty. Oh, Misty. We're seeing them now. There's Misty all over the place. <laughs> Misty's written everywhere. Yeah. This is a nice free library. No. We're not playing around. No. Not real. playing around. Yeah, this is a really pretty little old church. It is. I love the um, river that runs through it. I know. Not quite a river, it's well, a drain. It might be. <laughs> yeah, it's about to be. Here in a minute. Cool. Well, that's all I really cared. Oh, that guy looks like a little bones over there. Yeah. I hope it's not. <laughs> bones? <laughs> Bones? <laughs> if that's you, Bones, come with us. Come on, come on out. <laughs> oh, remember how my clip didn't, wasn't good of me talking about the well? Oh, the well. Maybe let's walk towards okay. it. Okay, let's redo the well. We're redoing the well. Here's the original well. <laughs> we think this is the original well. We do. They might actually both be the wells because they have multiple wells. Oh, That true. go to different depths and such, so, I don't know. Those are the wells. Those are the wells, mineral yeah. wells. It is cool that of all of the um, mineral companies that open, this is like the only one you can still yeah, come and get mineral water from. The original one. It's cool, yeah. Because whenever this was, before the whatever Great Depression was happening and people stopped coming here, there were all kinds of these types of companies. There were several mineral bottling companies like this. Yeah, I think it said there was like 23 of them. Wow. Or something at one point. Yeah. It is really cool. Even this one did go out of business for a while, actually. Yeah. I That's think really it was cool. until Famous bought it. Oh, listen. 
I wasn't, ex I don't know why I thought it was made of stone. I wasn't expecting it to be hollow. <laughs> Wow, very Let's cool. We do. Yeah. We move on. Moving on. <laughs> well, okay, y'all, since it's starting to rain now, we're just gonna drive around. We're gonna drink our sparkling waters and we're gonna let Bones kind of sightsee out the window as we tour more of Mineral Wells. shop and little stores in the bottom. That's cool. It is Nazareth, isn't it? Yeah, it's Nazareth Hospital. Well, children's services. Their song's coming now. Oh, they're gonna pass me. That's okay. <laughs> Yeah, well, I wonder if that would ever be turned into anything or just demolished. I don't know. It just depends on how the baker does. Yeah. Like everything in this town probably depends on how the baker does. Honestly, that's probably very true. Everything that isn't already refurbished. And yeah, yeah. Like a lot of these buildings could be saved if people keep coming here.
it was just gonna drizzle. Sightseeing to do in this weather. I can't even, yeah. All right, no going. sights to see. Let's go back to the hotel, eat some sandwiches. Let's do it. All right, well, we are back in the hotel room. We're gonna have some lunch, hang out for a little bit. We brought stuff to make sandwiches. So here's our sandwiches. We're having these Cintron energy drinks that we found in the dumpster a few videos ago. Yeah, we're just gonna hang out. Howdy, there's bones. <laughs> there's bones. Exploring. Yes. He loves sitting in the window right there. He's just watching the world go by. power nap and now we are going into the crazy hotel we're trying to find their little coffee shop so we can get some coffees all of their coffees oh yeah it's right there are made with mineral water uh, so that's really cool look at this We had. I wish it came in that bottle. I know. It is really fascinating to see all of the different bottling companies that yeah. came from here. Oh, oh, here's one of the famous ones. That's oh, the wow. Crazy Water brand. Oh wow, that's so cool. What and there's the crystals. Look. Oh, that's a cool key. Yeah, so these ones hanging were originally hung on the veranda of the Baker Hotel. I bet they looked beautiful when the light would shine through them. The first crazy hotel opened in 1913. So this is where we're, we're in this one right now. Oh wow, look at all this. Did you see all of this a film oh, wow. from the Crazy Water Hotel? This is why we do it. <laughs> this is why we do it. Dang, look at those keys. I know, buddy, it's so cool. photographer who yeah, rented out the donkey. There's like a photo of, this is like the founder, not this exact one, this is obviously. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> nice. <laughs> did we tell them that these oh. coffees are made with crazy water? Yes. I don't know if we did that or not. But I don't okay. know that we showed our little coffees. Here they are, crazy coffees. Crazy coffees. Oh, that's a cool mural. I've always liked that one. She's gone, she's leaving me. <laughs> she's on her way. I'm not stopping. Yeah, my bad. I'm here to sightsee. Okay. Thanks. I 
I gotcha. Appreciate it. No problem. <laughs> so it's just some of these storage spots. Filled with gold. Yeah. Junkers gold. Absolutely. Yeah, it's cool. <laughs> Wish we could get in there. There she is. All right, we're going up here now. We want to check out the historic post office building, which now says that it's a women's club. And then there's also a really cool house up on the hill that was basically the first thing we saw when we got into town yesterday, right across from the baker. Do you want me to take that one? Oh yeah, let me trade him. Let's not do it in the road. No, <laughs> you're in the middle of the street. Got him? Yeah. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, little bony. Just kidding. Just okay. young bones. Okay. Oh yeah, he's chilling back there. Okay, let's see. Well, post office, a surge of growth in this city after 1900 created a need for a larger post office. This structure was the third facility built here after postal service began in 1882. Closed in 1959. Does it say anything about the women's club? No. Oh, it's definitely still in use. Hi, <laughs> Mom. Yeah. I bet it still is the women's club. It looks nice in there. Oh, oh boy, <laughs> Alex. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I thought there was a step around it and there was not. <gasps> that scared me. Yeah, I mean, I guess it's just like a community space. Yeah, it's neat. For the women of Mineral Wells. Try to get a cute little shot showing y'all bones at the Baker Hotel, but he's kind of just chilling in his bag. You want to pop out and say hi? There you go, but don't jump out. This is his first time with this backpack, so he isn't understanding that he can. Oh, look, he wants to just hang out the top. Go back in. All right, that was your nice little. There you go, we got our clip. <laughs> Let's see. There you go. Good job, Bone. Um. <laughs> like a decapitated. <laughs> yeah, got his little net caught. Are you just a curious kitty cat? Put your head back inside. Look at your little claws. Oh, good job, Bunny. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing pretty good for his first outing. He really is. It's a good backpack. Dang, we're back. It is a pretty amazing building. It really is. There's the ghost on the window, if y'all can see that right on floor five. There's a ghost in the window. It's always rumored that this is haunted, but I think that's just because it's massive and it's abandoned. It's abandoned for <laughs> so, five decades. Yeah. Of course it's haunted. Let's go up and see this cool house we talked about. used to be. The front says it's 
Oh, it does say a, a boutique. It's got a nice big mural of the baker. Yeah, and it was 2019, so it's mm -hmm. not that old. This might just be a COVID casualty. Yeah, man, and... I'm trying to figure that out. It's like... Are these vines? I Did they grow into it from somewhere? I wonder. Look, there they are up there, maybe. I bet they just found a crack and flourished in the natural light. That's kind of incredible. I was kind of curious about this little thing. I saw a family go in there, but I never saw them come out. <laughs> <laughs> Some stay to this day. Yeah, they might still be this in here. The second most haunted building in <laughs> Wells. Let's go in. Crazy Water Garage Sale, Friday and Saturday. That's a cool, I'm gonna take a picture of that. What is this little spot, y'all think? Oh. Huh, just a little, maybe it used to be used for storage or something. Okay. <laughs> I'm going back that way. Now <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, there we go. We're back at the truck. All right, y'all. <laughs> we were up just wandering around, and look at this incredible view of the Baker. You can see it out in the distance. It, look, you can see their original steps. Yeah, there used to be some type of, I guess, a house. Looks like the foundation. And now it's, it's kind of a nice little turnout. What a fun thing to just stumble upon. That's called exploring. It is. Don't stop. Can't stop. Won't stop. Never stop. <laughs> I don't want to try to get like, the perfect shot of the flower. Okay. Don't give up. You work on that. I'm working on getting the perfect shot of the baker. This is like so nicely. It is cool. Colorful. Okay, let's just take one together. A little selfie. Oh, let's take one. I don't know if you can. Oh, our view went away. <laughs> okay. <laughs> See it back there? Yeah. It's right there. <laughs> Gotta love her, huh? <laughs> All right, y'all. Well, it is our final morning here in Mineral Wells. We wanted to come get more of the crazy water because it was really good. So we're back at crazy water. Alex is running in to get us a case. Me and Bones are hanging out out here. Say hi, Bones. <laughs> <laughs> I like, he's so good at doing that. He's very responsive. I think he knows his name. So we're just hanging out, I'm gonna grab a case like I said, then we're gonna swing by the Baker Hotel one last time just to say bye to it, and then we will be on our way back home. So we definitely want to keep doing these little small road trips over this spring and summer. We've really enjoyed bringing y'all along with us for this one. We hope that you've enjoyed getting to tag along and Bones really has enjoyed the trip. And here comes Alex. Got our case of crazy water. <laughs> here we go. I don't know where to go. <laughs> oh yeah. Here, Bonnie. Yeah, it's a case on sale for $12. It's 20 bottles. 20? 20 12 ounce bottles. Well, there we go. We grabbed our case. It was more bottles than I thought that it was going to be. Yeah, it was going to be the 12 pack. Yeah, so that's awesome. So we're going to swing by, say bye to the baker. Well, okay, you guys, we're back here to say bye to the baker and look. <laughs> they weed eated. They mowed everything. They heard us talking. They did. Yesterday or the day we got here, maybe, we were saying they're going to need to cut all this down. It was up to the fence height and you can really see it now a lot better. Yeah, it's smells. cleared it out quite a bit. Really tell. And it smells more, nice. It's like a much better view of the pool and the fountain. Yeah, so that turquoise thing standing up, that's the fountain inside the pool. There's the little like gatehouse right there with a nice uh, walkway across. And there's the big, that's the big main entrance. So we can drive here and then look through that gate and show them the main yeah. entrance. Yeah.
Ooh, it's raining. It is starting to rain. All right, let's go over to the where the gates yes. open a little bit. All right, so this gate is more see-through right here. Wow, look at that. Yeah. A little like bridge right there to the pool. Classy. Very classy. There's the main entrance with the nice red brick stairs. Oh, wow! Those lanterns along the stairs were in the museum. You can tell those oh, are kind yeah, of the right. same ones. The, design. the color is just gone from these. spending the weekend with the baker yeah. hopefully we'll be able to come back and stay when it's all renovated and if we're able to we'll definitely show you guys that you've seen it now and it'll be really cool to see it when it's all beautiful again in its prime well probably never in its prime it's, prime. <laughs> it's new prime, it's new prime. say bye to the baker bye bye, <laughs> bye baker <laughs> Thanks for watching y'all. Hope you enjoyed our little travel vlog. See you next time.